This is Insider Medicine in 60 from Washington. Two years after a widespread E. coli outbreak, the FDA has approved the use of ionizing radiation for fresh spinach and lettuce. The irradiation process can help control harmful bacteria and give leafy greens a longer shelf life. To date, several foods have been approved for radiation treatment, including meat, poultry, spices, and some types of shellfish. The foods must carry a special logo to indicate that they have been treated with radiation. From Toronto, according to research in the journal Clinical Pharmacology and Therapeutics, breastfeeding mothers taking codeine after childbirth may be putting their baby at risk. Researchers have discovered that about 1 in 20 women ultra-metabolize codeine, converting it into an excessive amount of the potent narcotic morphine, which can end up in the breast milk. The researchers indicate that doctors and medical organizations may need to consider a change in prescribing practice. And finally, from Sweden, according to a study in the journal Respiratory Research, snoring may be linked to various factors in childhood. In a study of nearly 16,000 people, researchers found that being hospitalized before the age of two, suffering from ear infections as a child, growing up in a large family, and being exposed to a dog in the home as a newborn were all independent risk factors for snoring in later life. The researchers note that snoring is more than just a nuisance, as those who snore have an increased risk for heart attack, stroke, and early early death. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.